I am Keith Roy Halliday, Acting Chief Executive Officer of the Barbados Water Authority. However, today I want to address you not as a CEO, but as a resident, in fact, as a national, as a homeowner, and as a family man. The Barbados Water Authority has been mandated by government to provide quality water to all of Barbadians, as well as the provision of wastewater services. And we can only do that within the confines of what is practical. And outside of climate change impact, we can only do that through what is our existing infrastructure on our existing means to do so. What am I saying? I'm saying that there is reliance on the Barbados Water Authority to perform in its delivery of water, but we cannot do so realistically in all circumstances. I think it is really appreciated or has been appreciated over the years that whenever we're dealing with an emergency situation such as an emergency event or hurricane event, that we, first of all, will have to go through a lockdown to protect our infrastructure. And on resumption of that lockdown, we have to deal with the issues that confront us. We were very fortunate that we did not suffer the worst circumstance of Category 4 hurricane burial. But even so, we recognized that we would have had to respond to some several emergency situations, dealing first of all with the essential services, QEH and the like, and then seeking to work or assist the vulnerable. What is particularly concerning, however, is that we find ourselves stretched having to deal with a number of communities or a number of households within a limited span, almost from get-go, almost from the time all clear is given. And that means that we still have pockets of communities or individuals who are not yet making the necessary preparation or storing water. Is it as simple as that? We have heard this over and over again, so much so that many people are, uh, are repeating it without thinking about it, which is you're storing five gallons of water per person, per household, per day. And the Barbados Water Authority has pleaded with you, or pleased with everyone, to ensure that they're storing water. And this we have done over the years and the five days preceding any actual event. So I am pleading with you now I'm imploring you now to please take this seriously. We're in the first of five or six months of a hurricane season. We cannot afford to repeat the incidents where individuals are caught not only unawares, but caught without a sufficient water store. In the worst circumstances, we've seen it with the ash fall, we've seen it with the flash warning, we've seen it with other type of emergency events that the Barbados Water Authority has had to respond to. So I really need to just implore each and every one of you to be prepared. Take responsibility for your own personal water emergency management or your own personal water storage regardless. And in that regard, I would like you to make sure not only are you looking after your loved ones and your household, but you're taking the necessary preparations to be your brother's keeper where necessary. And please, please, stay safe. Storing water is essential. Five gallons per person per day for a minimum of three days is recommended for drinking and sanitation. Be water wise. This is a conservation tip from the Barbados Water Authority. I'm talking about water. Choose water first. Water. Choose water first. To view this or our previous episode again, please visit our website at www.barbadoswaterauthority.com. You can go to our socials as well on Facebook and Instagram, or please subscribe to our Water Wednesdays channel on YouTube. You can find us there.